Yeah, it's great to be here speaking in front of the most powerful man in the world, and also President Biden. <laughs> this is a strange place to do comedy. It's the first time I've ever told a joke and thought, gee, I hope the Undersecretary of Labor thought that was funny. <laughs> For almost 25 years, Lorne Michaels has guided my career, but let's focus on his accomplishments instead. I think the term genius is overused, but in Lorne's case, he said it was okay. Lorne never wanted Saturday Night Live to be easily defined. He wanted to keep it evolving and changing with the times and the taste of the viewers. And that evolution can be best charted through the musical guests that he chooses to appear each week. Through the years, some of the biggest names in rock and roll and pop, artists who were just about to set the charts on fire, all accepted his invitation to perform. Name the hottest act and you'd find them on Saturday night. From the Rolling Stones to Tina Turner, Foo Fighters, Prince, David Bowie, Lady Gaga, Ray Charles, Billie Eilish, Miley Cyrus, Bruno Mars, to Justin Timberlake. If you are music of the moment, you are on Saturday Night Live.